some news that's coming in the state of Karnataka, where the magnificent aero show in Bengaluru enters its third day. The huge event provides an opportunity for India to form ties with the global firms. This event showcases India's strong growing defense capabilities with the display of missiles and drones. One drone, such drone, is the Tapas, which is the tactical airborne platform for aerial surveillance beyond horizon. The resolution of uh, Tapas output proves that it is capable of destroying every nefarious uh, design of the army without any risk. This unmanned vehicle can send us live pictures by keeping an eye on every movement on the enemy's land. My colleague Toya Jakshi spoke to the director of Tapas drone. Let's take a look at that. For Indian, India's defense. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm the Director General for Electronics and Communication Systems, Dr. Vikadas. Uh, so far as uh, you're talking about TAPAS, see TAPAS is the UAV, the un, uh, uh, unmanned aerial vehicle, and that has been the need of the hour today to spread it across to the country and all our borders to ensure our security and the border surveillance from aerial. And today we have developed the systems with all kind of payloads, whether it is electro-optics payloads, radars payloads, EW systems, communication systems to be put up onto TAPAS. And I'd be very happy to know the electro-optics payload has been integrated and flown and provided the live feed data and various programs. And this is an SD quality. Sir, and one more thing. Over the years, uh, we, we were depending the uh, equipment uh, by different countries. But now we are making our own equipment, sir. Absolutely. The reversal of technology has happened. India has geared up fully. All our technologies, the brain was always there. But the technology has been developed, and with the technology, the systems has been done. And when it comes to the systems, it is not we alone. It is the industries, the ecosystems, the startup. We have integrated all of them together. And making the lead system integrator, pulling all of them in a supply chain, we are able to develop very, very complex system and system of systems, which we could never think as an India, we could make it here. So that is why we are importing. Today, we are able to develop deliver, test and qualify our systems so that our country, our armed forces get the confidence that our own systems are going to do the best of the jobs. So what about the fifth gen fighter jets, sir? Quite a bit of a work is going on on that. See, this fighter jet does not come up over the sky. It comes up over the years of development, the design, the manifestations are going on. As you know, today, LCI is flying, Mark II is coming up, AMCA is on the design, on the, uh, the critical design reviews is going on. Ahead of it, it's the dead BF for the Navy. So there is a series of systems which have been come up. And as a country, today with our industries, with our labs, we are fully, fully equipped to develop the whole system.